Hello, welcome back to my legacy. It's Sunday morning. Everybody's up and enjoying their day. I think that McKinley is going to be going to recycle some things because we need to be able to have some bits for her to fabricate. And we also have Willow here. She just got done doing some things for work. She's dancing because she's a dancing machine. And we're going to have her do some things for social networking because she needs to stay on top of that for her career. Let's see how far you are in your career. Okay, so everything you have is complete. Your performance is average though, so we have to work on that. Sophia is getting the last of her acting skills. She is going to hit a 10 soon. There she goes. Good for you, girl. Yep, she hit a 10. Good, now we can practice some other things because you probably have to practice your debate too. So let's go ahead and have that. Oh, learn new lines. You can do that for drama club. And we are going to have you practice some speech too because it'd be handy for you to have that. McKinley is doing some things on the computer. And did you go and fabricate anything yet? We're gonna have to have you do that. What can we have you fabricate? How about you fabricate a rug? And we'll just recycle it again when you're done with that. And Ivy just got done practicing for cheer. I think we're gonna have her practice a little bit of yoga. Oh no, do you know what? We need to talk to her friend. Let's invite her over to the lot because we can't invite her on a date. We have not flirted with her or anything yet. Maybe she'll come over and Ivy can find out whether or not she is interested in her. Someone is calling Sophia. I hear you're not too good at haggling. Why don't you let me take you to the flea market and show you how a pro gets the price? We're going to cancel on that. Oh, what's the matter, turtle? Where are you? Are you stuck under the bed? Let's call her to eat. Ooh, this is good. Would you describe the family dynamic between Willow and Ivy as being jokesters? Absolutely. If anything will correct their relationship together from what happened before, I think this will be it. Oh, turtle, you poor thing. You were stuck under the bed. Oh, you're back under there again. Okay, Ivy's doing her yoga. And Sterling, we need you to start practicing for your scouts. Let's have you knit some beanies. We'll do a blue bear beanie this time. Oh, there's your friend. We just saw her. Let's go ahead and show off outfit. We'll ask about her day. McKinley is hanging out, but she still did not fabricate anything. And she needs to get the aspiration goal up. And I guess you have to scrap that fabrication, huh? Let's see if we can do it again this time. We're going to fabricate a table like maybe that'll work out for you. Willow, will you please come over here and call Turtle to eat? I bet you she's really hungry and she seems irritated. Maybe it's because of the storm. But let's concentrate on Ivy and her friend. Oh, she's fixing our vacuum for us. That's so sweet. Let's obsess about favorite celebrity. Let's flirt with her. Maybe she will like her back. See how well that works out for you guys. Thank you for fixing our vacuum. When it comes to authority, younger Sims just do not know how to respect their elders. And it's certainly looking that way between Sterling and Willow. Family members with a difficult family dynamic will be mean to each other more often. The younger Sim will be less likely to follow the rules or demands of the older Sim. And the younger Sim will complain to the older Sim more often. Oh, Sterling and Willow have a difficult family dynamic? Okay, yes. Oh, what happened? In there let's flirt again we will compliment appearance but she does not have a crush on her but that's not necessarily something that we need to do discuss the latest games oh she's embarrassed why is she embarrassed we'll flirt with her one more time and see how it works out here let's ask her if she's single are you single by chance oh well she is single let's see if we can ask her on a date yes we can let's go out we'll get to know each other better and she doesn't seem oh she's bored she's really bored yeah we definitely need to take her out on a date okay we're at the lounge i think we're gonna go and get ourselves some drinks oh it doesn't look like someone's attending the bar up downstairs let's see if someone's upstairs yes let's order a drink for the group how about we order some sweet and spices oh yeah we're gonna do it up we're gonna have a big old round of drinks for just me and her Oh, I guess we're going to be buying drinks for him too. Oh no. That's okay. We're doing really well right now as far as our simoleons go. So we can splurge a little bit, impress her. And how about we sit over here? We can talk for a little bit. We can get to know each other. Oh, it's prank day. We have to worry about our date. We're not worried about prank day. Who's uncomfortable? She is embarrassed still. I hope she wasn't embarrassed by her flirting with her. We are on a date, so if she didn't want to come, she would just said no. We can express admiration towards her and we can have a deep conversation with her. We have to tell her a story. We can compliment her and her outfit. We can do an inside joke. We can tell her a story. Oh, she has a crush on her. Oh, good. We can brighten her day. Let's do a little bit of flirting. We can compliment her appearance. We can embrace her too. Well, it's really good that she has a crush on her. Let's reveal our crush. We can tell we have a crush on her. Maybe she'll have a crush back or she'll like her too. Seems like she's really receptive. Yeah, okay. 
Oh, nice. Can we kiss her yet? Well, we can't declare love publicly yet. Let's do a pickup line on her. Does she like it? Oh, she thinks it's cute. Great. Let's talk about some things. We can talk about the warm temperature. We still have not told you a story yet. We can tell an unbelievable story. First kiss. Oh, how sweet. Sheila words thinks Ivy is swell and wants to become best friends. Yes. If it doesn't work out for them, then they can still be best friends. We got a gold medal too. Well, we're going to get going. It was really nice to have a nice date with you. That was very unexpected. She has a crush on her, so she really likes her. We can do compliments. We can compliment her outfit, and then we're going to go. It was nice talking to you. We, I'm glad we had a really good date together, but we're going to get going, girl, because we have some things to do at home. Oh, it is raining outside. McKinley, I bet you didn't even do your fabrication. Let's see if you went up on your skills. Let's see if you can fabricate a rug real quick. I know it's raining out, girl, but we need to get this aspiration goal up. Oh, you did. Oh, and you almost have enough for a money tree. I don't know if we should get one of those. Do you think we should get one? Let's see how you're doing with your fabrication here. Oh, you did hit a five. Good for you, girl. We have to achieve level seven in fabrication. Collect insects from an insect farm three times and create five candles. Oh, we have to get a candle station. Oh boy. I don't know where we're gonna put that, but we can have that in the house in the hallway or something. Ivy is practicing her debate. Let's see how Sterling is because we have need to concentrate on him next. He wants to be friendly with Albert and he wants to chat with Taku, but I want to see how he's doing in his progress with the scouts. So let's have him view the badge progress. I just saw sparks from over here. I don't know where they came from. Maybe lightning. Let's see how you're doing. Civic responsibilities, five out of eight. Let's see how you didn't even make crafts, drawings, or paintings. I guess we're going to be having to make paintings. We're going to have to do as much as possible with you. And I don't know. Maybe we should just go ahead and do this. Is this painting done yet? No, we'll just go ahead and scrap it. Sophia, on the other hand, we need to have you practice some, some debate and we have to put up a mirror for you because Ivy started doing her debates. So we're going to have to have a second mirror for you guys. There we go. You can practice your new lines and what else can we do here? Practice debate too. Let's see how everything is on the calendar. Oh no. Oh, today is Sophia's birthday. I didn't even realize. Let's invite over her boyfriend. We need to make sure that he's here for when she ages up because we need to age him up as well. You can do that later, girl. And McKinley needs to make you a cake. She's terrified to be outside right now. So rightfully so, she needs to cook a cake. And while you're making that, Sophia can talk with her boyfriend. She wants to ask out her old crush, but now that she's aging up, we can actually break it off with him, which is great because we need to stop thinking about Dayton. Hopefully he comes over. Albert is sleeping? Oh, it's 1230. I didn't even realize how late it was. McKinley's going to have to hurry up and make that cake before you age up. We don't want anyone to think that they forgot their birthday was forgotten about. Good. McKinley, can you put some candles on there for her? We're going to age her up. Let's get everybody over here in the kitchen. Go ahead and blow out the candles. Happy birthday. See you in the next video.